Part C asks, is the number of pounds of banana on the display table increasing or decreasing at t equals 5? We're trying to find out if the rate is either positive or negative. And the rate is going to be comparing the rate values of f of t and g of t. So we want to just plug in into our calculator. We can either use that function. We can just use a calculator calc value function. And we want to find f of t at 5. Okay, and when we plug that in, we're going to end up with 13.7959. So I'm going to write that 796. And this is going to be pounds per hour. Okay, and that's decreasing since they're taking it away. And for the g function, we're just trying to find g of 5. And that we're adding on, and the rate at which g of 5, so we're actually finding the value of g, because that's going to give us the rate of increase. It's going to be 11.5328, so we're just going to round that to 533, and that's going to be increasing in pounds per hour. So when we combine these rates together, so f of g, f of 5, uh, actually, maybe I'll write it this way. So we're going to have our positive rate for g of 5 minus the negative rate, which is f of 5. And if we subtract these two values, we're going to end up with a, a negative value. So 11.533. So we go 11.533 minus 13.5. 7, 9, 6. We have to be careful of sign. We have to make either going to add the negative or we're going to subtract. And we end up with a negative rate. So this is 2.263 and this is pounds per hour. So we can say that the, amount, the number of pounds of table on the table display is decreasing at t equals 5 because when we add the positive rate and the negative rate together, we get a net negative rate.